let's hop into my regrets with the lip quiver. You know that ugly cry? <laughs> and I'm telling you why I ain't going. Yeah, these are going. Hi guys, welcome back for another video. It is Melissa Q, it's your girl, yes. And we are here talking about products that I regret trying and buying. Yes, now bruh, we don't like these. Before we deep dive into the products that I tried and I regret buying, yes, I tried and buy it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I can't wait mm -mm 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 -mm. because I know you're going to love the contents on here. Yes. Comment down below and let me know what do you feel like you wasted the coin on. Okay. Everybody's been there. So <laughs> let's deep dive and get into it. Okay. So I got it in a Tarjay bag because you know, my trash can be somebody else's tra treasure. So when I say that I'm trashing these, it, it's just out of my life. It doesn't mean necessarily that they're being thrown in the garbage can because these will be recycled. They will be either thrown away if it's old, but if it's old, yeah, I definitely regret buying it. I didn't even use it. But anyway, all I'm saying is that I'm giving it a new home. Okay. So I do have some people that will love these products. The first one. Ugh. Okay. It looks disgusting at the top, <laughs> but it is the Aussie three minute miracle. Um, this one is the curl deep conditioner. It was good, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's all right. I feel like that the regular one for some reason is better. This one for thirst, this one is for thirsty curls. Not so thirsty. I'm not that thirsty, sis. Okay. This was not that good. I regret trying this because this was sent to me. The shampoo y'all that was a deep regret this one was probably the best product of this line but i still like low-key regret it because the aussie i don't know that one has more slip i was thinking about that and it's just no no aussie just keep it down on that okay keep it down on that and keep the one you know, don't, don't, don't go for this one. Just do the other one. You know what I'm just saying? Y'all know my love for Diva Curl. Yes. But this right here, this right here, yes. This set it free locked me up. This is the Diva Curl set it free moisture lock finishing spray. Y'all, this had me in tangles and dangles. Okay. Just because as glycerin as the devil is in it. <laughs> I know. I had to say it like that, y'all. But. It is not for me, and it's for it's a shine and finishing spray, y'all. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. No para me, okay. Missy Pela was like, "Go get that away from me, okay." No, this would probably someone that loves glycerin will love a product like this. I don't want to say that these products are not good. They just Missy Pela was like, "Girl, step back before I jump forward and." You know, we classy. We don't do that, Missy. Products that make you want to shave your hair off, stay away from them. This one just gave me some tangles and dangles and bangles and sis. I, I can't do it. Whoo! Let's talk about this, y'all. Okay, let me tell you something. First of all, what happens? I go through these and you will see these in my empties videos because I end up using shampoo as body wash when I don't like it. So even though it's an empty, y'all, I'm gonna still keep it 100 and tell y'all the real deal. This right here, <sniffs> hair did not like, okay? It's the Shea Moisture Fruit Fusion Coconut Water Weightless Shampoo. I kinda like this at first, but then I was like, it's doing something to my hair. Hold up. It was giving me some foam, but I felt like it was stripping it and making my hair like straw. I was like, sis, I've never, I, I don't like shampoos that do that. And that's why my, my curly hair routine is changed where I'm only going to use a cleansing conditioner. And we will talk about that. That's why we having some co-wash changes and I'm doing some reviews with some co-washes. I'm trying some right now, but this Shea Moisture is hit and miss for me anyway. Um, there are certain things that I really love. It's like a love hate. Okay. Either my hair loves it and it's like, mi amor. Yes. Or it says, hate. Oh. Give it the hand. Dale lo. Okay? Mm -mm. This right here? This right here? I wanted to love so much because some of y'all have talked about this. This is the Curl Mix Pure Avocado Moisture Hair Softener. Now, it's lemon cream fragrance. Oh, so, so good. It has distilled water. It has avocado butter. It has argan oil. And what's the fourth? 
ingredient? <laughs> the devil. Vegetable glycerin, y'all. I was so sad. But I'm going to give this a, a good home because I feel like that this is a product uh, like even the other ingredients. I was like, sis, why do you? Curl Mix, if you ever have a glycerin-free product, call me. Call me. Call me. This, I feel like it would be really, really good if it did have a glycerin. But we have to move on. We got to pass on. Mm. Y'all remember when I when I reviewed this? This was, you know what? This is good. No, no. I tried to, you know, when you try to make stuff work, we over that, okay? We turning 40, shorty 40 this year, okay? We are over making things, trying to make things work. We not trying to make it work, okay? So the Cream of Nature Argan Oil from Morocco Strength and Shine Leave-In Conditioner. Um, this would be good for someone with relaxed hair. Let let's 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 give it a home. But my hair that I majority like curly. Um, no, I don't know if it's the silicones. I don't know what is in here. My hair liked it. It likes it at first, but I definitely can't refresh it with this. I feel like there's someone with that loves glycerin could probably work with a a pair of product like this. Well, well with my hair f fine and being frizzy, I'm gonna tell you what this does in my hair. You ready? You ready? Cotton candy. I look like the carnival. Yes, I look like a carnival with this. I'm so sorry, Cream of Nature. I love your edge control, but your leave-in conditioner got to go. It got to go. Y'all yeah. know I paid some money for this, okay? The current <laughs> was not low on this. Moroccan oil is no joke. This is the hydrating silent cream. Now, let me talk about this. My hair actually really likes this on first day. Hair is so fly. It does the same thing as the Diva Curl Styling Cream. If you hadn't checked out that video, go check it out. And you'll see why Missy Payla was like, no, 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 no. This contains isopropyl alcohol. So if, if glycerin is the devil, alcohol, <laughs> alcohol is death, okay, to my hair. My hair is already dry. Do you know what isopropyl alcohol does to my hair? Missy Palo looks like she 80 years old. If I'm short at 40, isopropyl alcohol make, doubles the, it, it gives my hair wrinkles, okay? No, but the hair looks so good in the beginning, but it's so bad. It's like junk food, okay? It's instantaneous pleasure food, but in the end, your body just feel like trash in the end. Oh, I don't know. Maybe someone who has oily hair because of uh, isopropyl alcohol will suck the life out of your hair. Shea Moisture. Surprise. Yes. This is the sugar cane extract and metal foam seed silicone free miracle style of leave in treatment with marshmallow root. Yes, my hair loves all of that. But guess what it has in it? How do I say Satan? It has glycerin. <laughs> No, why your hands? It just makes me so sad. It makes me so sad. Shea Moisture, listen to me. Have a have a glycerin-free line and see who comes for it. All the high porosity people. Not maybe not all of us. Even some low porosity people. So we you have some glycerin-free stuff. Shea Moisture, you got a line every every new moon. Okay, come with a glycerin free line. I promise the people will come for it. <laughs> Unfortunately, all of these is being silicone free, a miracle styler, leave in treatment. Oh, sugar cane extracts and metal foam. Don't that sound good? Maya was like, sis, don't lie to me. That's what <laughs> Missy Palo said about this product. So, oh. Well, those are the products that I regret trying and buying. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to get it a thumbs up and hit the notifications because it's going to let you know when your girl is doing the upload and it's like, ting, ting. So I hope you guys enjoy it. I will see you in the next video. Bye.